Our next letter, the eighth letter of the Hebrew alphabet, is Chet. That's often written H-E-T or, well, H-E-T or H-E-T-H. And the transliteration for a ch is not always standard. We could make this an H with a dot underneath it. So het or het. And this looks a lot like a hay. Remember our hay, we had that what looked like a dalit, and then it came up and there was a gap, the het closes that gap off. So our het has that dalit like looking first part and then it closes off the left hand side. It looks kind of like a box without a bottom. So just horizontal stroke, straight vertical stroke, and then straight vertical stroke. So that is our chet, and the chet is pronounced in the throat. Sometimes people will say ch, but it's it would be a hard ch, kind of like in the name Bach. And so it's a throat kind of a sound, a ch. And so it's hard to write. You put the h with a maybe a, a dot underneath it to to indicate that, but it's not natural in English, a little bit more so in German. So it's this H sound that we get if we pronounce Bach the way the Germans do. So that is our Chet.